Hey there, it's Gabe with API Nation. Hey, if you're running Facebook ads to get leads, you wanna follow up with those leads as fast as possible. Ideally within the first five minutes of them clicking on your ad. If you wait even till 10 minutes, your odds of qualifying that lead drop 80%. So you need to follow up immediately. And therein lies the problem. When somebody clicks on your ad, great. Then their information goes into the abyss of Facebook. You have to go find that CSV file where all your leads are kept, download it, go through it, and then you can follow up. Unless you have a full-time assistant whose only business is checking for leads all the time so that you can follow up within the first five minutes, you're gonna miss that window. So what do you do? You automate it so that anytime somebody clicks your lead, it automatically goes to a Google Sheet, which you can have open, and you can immediately call them, email them, or have this sheet feed into a marketing tool or a marketing team. It makes collaboration easier, it makes follow-up quicker, and it only takes a minute to set up. Let me show you. So first, I am going to go to apination.com. That's where we're connecting apps to make your life a lot easier. I'll click on Discover Connections, and here you'll see a bunch of different apps you can connect to save time. We're gonna connect Facebook lead ads. Once you click on it, you'll see the CRMs and marketing tools you can connect Facebook lead ads to. We're gonna connect it to Google Sheets. Google Sheets is super flexible. It's one of my favorite things to connect my lead ads, my marketing tools, my CRM to. So we're gonna click Use Workflow. And it's gonna take me to the first step of connecting these apps. And connecting apps at API Nation is so easy. We want it to just work for you. So I'm just gonna click this button, connect Facebook lead ads. It's gonna ask for authorization. Absolutely, let's do it. Bam, we're halfway there. Now we're gonna connect Google Sheets. Really similar thing. We're gonna sign into the Google account where we want this sheet to live. I'm gonna use my professional Google account. That way it's sitting there in that Google Drive. And this is it. We're gonna configure a few things so it works exactly how we want, but then we're ready to go. First, we're gonna select the business page. So if you're running a few different pages, you can choose whichever page you are running this ad for. I'm gonna run it for this real estate team. And then you're gonna choose the form that you've attached to the ads you're running. In this case, I am running my one, two, three, four example street. Make sure to save. Below, you can rename the Google Sheet. For example, this would be Facebook leads from one, two, three, four example street ad. Be sure to save it again. And then down here, you'll see the mapping. Basically any information from Facebook that comes over is gonna come over to Google Sheets. I encourage you to set up your lead form for first and last name instead of full name. It just makes it easier to use with a lot of different marketing tools, including MailChimp, Constant Contact. Most CRMs are gonna want a first and last name rather than a single full name. So that's what we've done here, first, last name. Make sure this is saved. This is ready to go, and this is it. I hit the button, the sync is running. Our little automation is checking Facebook ads all the time to see if there's anybody new. That way I can follow up with them within the first minute, within the first five minutes, and be way more successful, qualify and convert way more leads by having them instantly show up on my Google Sheet. If you have any questions, feel free to shoot us an email, give us a phone call. We're API Nation connecting the world's applications. We love doing this stuff.